Now this is a little something different. A week ago, I've had these uh, marinating for a week, but a week ago I sliced a gala, a couple of gala apples, maybe two or three, and I, I sprinkled sugar. I, first of all, I squeezed lemon juice over it, over all the slices, and that's what's kept them as, as the brown that you see is a cinnamon, not brown apple, but that's what kept the apple from getting brown and discoloring. But then I sprayed, I sprayed, I squirted fresh lemon. I used fresh lemon. Then I put sugar over all of it, sprinkled sugar and cinnamon. Then I buy apple, I mean, sugar and cinnamon mixed together in a, in a shaker. And then I put them in this Ziploc bag. I added more cinnamon and sugar in there, shook it up, and then I stored it in the refrigerator for a week. And this is what I have. Now I'm gonna try something a little different with this. I'm gonna put these marinade cinnamon, sweet cinnamon apple slices with a little lemon. I had to put this on my post what I did and uh, and these are all galas but I don't I don't know that it makes any difference which apple you use well it does make a difference but, but it's just that each apple is going to do its own thing it's going to give you a different variety of flavor okay so there I have I think what I'm going to do just to be I'll try to pour whatever liquid I can in there. That's that's a rarity. Now what I'm going to do, I'm going to put, I have this Kentucky Tavern bourbon, which is a decently flavored bourbon. It, some argue that it's not the best bourbon, and I guess it's not the best, but I, the, the best Kentucky bourbon, in my opinion, is Elijah Craig. But this is a decent little bourbon for the money, Kentucky Tavern. So I, 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 I filled up a cup of, with, with bourbon and, and a cup of bourbon, and I'm pouring, it was only about a half of a cup of liquid because this is so full of, of fruit. The other things I've done, I've not been as full. Now I'm going to put a lid and a band on this. And I'm going to store this in a dark, cool place for at least three days, and then we'll see what we have. 